The ad has likely snuck into your Facebook feed, asking, can you run an 8-minute mile? Runners have a 35% lower risk of all-cause mortality and could qualify for lower rates on life insurance. Is it true? Health IQ, the company running the Facebook ad, did not respond to repeated requests to talk to Runner's World. Advertisement You might like the iPhone 6s is too expensive. One radical thing to discover. Money experts see the dramatic changes in bodybuilders' physiques over the past 125 years men's health the most addictive game of the year. Play with 15 million players now. Forge of Empires 14 NSFW nude selfies We can totally get behind women's health super yacht trends mansion global women's 5,000 meters, Huddle wins her second event of the trials Newswire Runners World recommended by Daily Newsletter. Email address submit you may unsubscribe at any time. Privacy policy about us but it raises an interesting question. Can a love of exercise pay off in this way? The answer, from industry experts, is that it is possible, but it's more complicated than running a single 8-minute mile. Runners often score well in the kinds of outcomes insurance underwriters like blood pressure, cholesterol, ratio of weight to height and by which life insurance premiums are calculated. One study of 50,000 adults conducted at Iowa State University and elsewhere showed that running as little as 4 to 5 miles a week as slowly as 11 or 12 minutes a mile reduces the prospect of death from heart problems by 45% and extends lifespans by as much as 3 years compared to not running. At least one major life insurance carrier, John Hancock, has introduced a plan that gives discounts of up to 15% to customers who meet exercise goals measured by fitness trackers, a move observers say may be the beginning of a trend. Since running improves HDL that is, the good cholesterol and keeps weight and blood pressure down, those who run may be at an advantage when it comes to being eligible for the best life insurance premium rates available from insurers, said Stephen Rigatti, MD. Vice President and Chief Medical Officer at the Mutual Life Insurance Company Mass Mutual. But that's only part of the process of determining a premium. Industry experts say your personal or family medical history may overshadow your exercise habits. In a few cases, participation in extreme sports triathlon among them could increase scrutiny from life insurance rate setters. Some runners may not check out as healthy as they appear, said Kyle Winkfield managing partner of the Washington, D.C. financial planning firm Odell, Winkfield, Roseman and Amp, Ship. Just because you run doesn't mean you're going to get these awesome rates. While running generally reduces the chance of having high blood pressure by more than 4%, according to the American Heart Association, Winkfield said some runners still may have higher blood pressure, or medical histories that include surgeries or other issues. You could be a really accomplished runner, but you had a heart attack 10 years ago, said Winkfield, who was a decathlete in college. Runners often do score well in a category underwriters also often ask about, what they eat. If you're a great runner and you enjoy it, make sure your nutrition is as sound as your passion for running is, said Winkfield, who is also co-author of the book Success on a Mics. Oh, 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 oh,
Now I give my praises to you.